Hi, I'm Jill Taylor at Global Graphics Software, the developers of the Harlequin Rip. And here I am at Label Expo 2015 in Brussels on the Colourdyne stand with Kim Beswick, who's the general manager of Memjet, and Eric Nelson, who is the uh, VP of product development at Zytron. So Kim, we're here on Colourdyne. They're your, one of your customers and they're using Memjet technology with the Harlequin Rip. They are. They're actually using Memjet technology in three different classes of uh, print engines. So they have their production class engine, which is here today at the show. And that's got multiple print heads in it, automatically integrated with the Harlequin Rip um, from Zytron. Uh, they also have a mini press version, uh, their 20, 20, 2600 series and their 1600 series, which does desktop labels and also mailing and addressing color envelopes and things like that. And they actually use the RIP across the entire spectrum of technology from desktop all the way up to their production presses. So very scalable technology then? Very scalable and it's wherever customers want to manipulate control, you know, change color in a way that makes it compatible with their brand image or their product image in the context of labels. Wherever they want to control that specifically, they bring in the RIP to be able to add that additional functionality. So what a great software engine we've got there, okay? Zytron's one of our longest standing customers. I know you've been a customer of Harlequin for ages. Um, what, is, uh, what does Harlequin bring to the Memjet technology? It has a bunch of technology for variable data. It's very fast. Years and years of work has been done at Global Graphics to make it very fast. So we rip a page in a tenth of a second or less. It's also very scalable. We have built a system that takes files in and splits it up and then we pass it out to as many Harlequin rips we need uh, as we need to. So Memjet keeps making the system faster. Later this month, they're going to make it 500, uh, 500 feet a minute. And we have uh, the ability to just plug in more Harlequin rips uh, to be faster. And this is one of the big trends, isn't it? Everybody needs more horsepower, everybody's going faster, needs yeah. to rip pages quicker. But also color is very important these days in, in the marketplace. So I think you were saying earlier that color, color across all the applications that Memjet technology is used on is critical. It's true. I mean, whether it's labels or mailing and addressing, you know, people are trying to control their brand color for sure, but they're also trying to control their product, their messaging, you know, the right color in terms of their marketing communications. That's critical. Um, and they want to do it quickly. I mean, one of the things that we hear about the Zytron Rip and the Harlequin, you know, inside architecture is that our customers, even on our highest end presses, like the one here, you know, running it. 275 feet per minute now, moving up to 500, that they don't have to wait for the technology. They never have to wait. They know that the file is going to be there and the rip is never the bottleneck. So that's just fantastic for us. And Kim was telling me earlier that Zytron have done a wonderful thing with the user interface. So you've taken Harlequin and then you've put a user interface around it and some workflow, is that, is that right? So we have a workflow and the client applications can run on uh, Windows or Macintosh. The, uh, we ship the RIP on a Windows machine, but people can use whatever they want. We have uh, color control tools. We use the built-in ICC profiling tools that come with the RIP, but we also have a couple of tools of our own for spot color matching and for general color correction. And it all works from the desktop or from right in front of the press, depending on where they want to work from. So it's fairly easy to use? Yeah. Uh, some of the people that use Memjet technology are using our uh, RIP on a touch screen by the press. And it's, yeah, it's, uh, it's very, very easy to use. Yeah. I would echo that actually. Uh, you know, we've got customers that are brand owners, small businesses, right. trying to do short runs of labels. You know, maybe a less sophisticated color processing environment. They need to be able to use the RIP sort of easily. And then we've got customers all the way up into the commercial print space that might have a very specific, you know, PostScript or PDF workflow that they're trying to map to, and they want it to work the way that it's always worked for them. Right. And so it's both, you know, translating existing workflows and also keeping it easy for some of our small business customers that still want to be able to control color. We wanted to make the color uh, usable for a person that doesn't even know what color management is, but they want to just fold a piece that they know works and hold it up and uh, uh, to the, the piece that doesn't work, and then make a few choices, print out another one, and hold it up and say yes. So we print out a bunch of swatches. Um, but we also want to be able to have people use uh, X-ray equipment or other densitometry to get an exact match with ICC profiling. So we have something that can be used by uh, a person that knows how to use a copy machine, and we have something that can be used by a professional printer company. Thank you both very much.